Piyushi, how are you doing? Hello ma'am, I'm good, how are you? Yeah, I'm good too, thanks. Okay, so first of all, uh, congratulations on receiving an admit from your dream university. And uh, can you let me know how was your experience with uh, working with MIMSC? So, uh, initially when, like I'll start from the beginning, initially when I decided uh, to study, I definitely like for sure needed some consultancy help. Uh, because there are a lot of things that as a student we don't know and I have nobody uh, who would help me with it. So a consultancy help was mandatory for me. And there were a lot of them available. Uh, you must be knowing surely on Google we find so many of them. And there's always an initial call and on that basis we uh, kind of decide which consultancy to follow, right? So I had uh, the first call uh, like with many people but with MIMSA the way they guaranteed that uh, you will definitely get uh, a lot of help and the help they were offering like the university shortlisting and uh, many other services I think visa services yeah yeah definitely visa services also and a consultant uh, special consultant that is allocated just for you which will be available 24 7 and uh, yeah the way uh, the person i think he, it was jatin sir the first call i think so so way, the way he assured me i knew that mmsa was the one i would want to take help from and zoya ma'am was allocated me allocated to me and to be honest uh, initial few days 3 to 4 days i'm not that sure if i should continue or not but the way Zoyam so helped me since day one, I knew that she's the person who will be helping me throughout and that is when actually this all was decided just because of Zoyam so to be honest, to continue with MIMSA and all the services, university shortlisting, whatever. I had so many doubts initially mm-hmm. and always Zoyam so was there to help. Jatin sir was also there sometimes when I needed some extreme help and then uh, you joined later on and you too helped a lot uh, for visa related services and many other like I had a doubts uh, to be asked to you as well so overall a great experience okay thank you so much and uh, were you given a proper clarity regarding what all process will be there from the beginning yeah 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 everything was very sure that is the reason I continued and took a decision to continue with MIMSA everything was very clear okay okay totally fine and uh, was the team able to help you with the proper country and school shortlisting according to your choice and your profile yeah yeah so i had a confusion initially in my mind which country which university which course actually to choose Mm-hmm. But uh, having a conversation with uh, you people, I got a I got a clarity on that, and uh, it I narrowed it down to exactly what I wanted to do. Okay, totally fine. And uh, how did MIMSA add value to your application? Okay, mm, yeah. So I would say uh, giving us one consultant that is just for your help i think that is the best uh, thing that uh, mmsa has provided me because Mm. i knew whatever problem i had different problem i knew who i should talk to and uh, because she's the authority that i am talking to she'll figure it out because i don't know whom to talk for a particular uh, problem and where to where to find a solution so i had to talk to her and she used, she used to always provide me the solution uh, gathering within few minutes few hours according to her time so i think that is the best thing that uh, was provided okay okay that's really great uh, also you had call with our uh, content expert uh, content team and uh, were they able to like extract proper information from yours and uh, regarding your profile to create the best cvs lors and essay yeah 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 actually uh initially i tried to figure out the lors sops and resume uh, on my own 
but uh, the day i had i had a conversation with the editor and yeah yeah the sop lo editor yeah. he he didn't ask me a particular question like like i'll, I'll be asking you a question and you answer it he didn't do that he uh, how do i say he just asked me my experience so how was how i was in my school and then college and how i progressed and why i decided to pursue my dream and all so yeah. he got a really good answer in general and the way he put it in the sops lors that was really impressive and i think uh, i i don't believe it could have been better than that uh, that was just absolutely best uh, service the editing services okay okay that's totally uh, nice and uh, what all universities did you apply to and uh, how many admits did you receive okay so uh, i don't have a count except because i kind of fluctuated and decided to drop out few universities from the list mm. but uh, oh, okay i'll tell you from university of Car- cardiff university i i got to uh, admit from there i applied for birmingham university of birmingham birmingham but didn't get an admit mm. i applied for university of surrey and i did i have received an admit from there as well uh university of exeter i applied there as well and received an admit from there too and university of glasgow from which i received an admit mm-hmm. and uh, yeah university of sheffield and didn't receive an admit so i think these are six in total and from four i received an admit four three, yeah four from four so out of six from four i've received the admit okay that's t- totally great also uh, what all were the post admit services uh, that were provided to you and how would you rate that okay so post admit services i think uh, those were the more essential ones which i required because applying i think is not that difficult but then understanding what to do when you receive an admit that is a, a totally important thing i believe so uh i knew that uh, i had lot of work after the admit and uh, zoya ma'am uh, helped me understand that i need to apply for scholarship education loan and visa and what uh, how to do it in what sequence so i shouldn't be applying for scholarship before i apply to the college so that is that doesn't mean anything so the sequence wise services which i should uh not services uh process that i should carry sequence wise which will be helpful i think that was really uh essential to understand the procedure okay okay that's totally nice and uh, like how would you recommend to your fellow mates or any other person regarding mimsa uh to be honest i have recommended to my friend who will be applying next year or maybe after that and uh, because i've received such a great service from your end he definitely if he he, he is going to definitely go uh, abroad for studies he is going to take service from you and i recommend this to everyone uh because uh seriously as a student we don't understand what things to do how to uh understand this procedure and if someone is helping you on that level to understand each and everything i think that is just a great service that you people are providing offering to us as students okay okay that's totally uh, great to hear and uh, thank you so much priyashi for taking out time for this uh, review and uh, also i would like to suggest if you can put up a google review on how was your experience so i guess that's it <laughs>